Hello guys, welcome. Today we will learn how to do these autumn leaves. They are really beautiful. Uh, is this all my um, all these leaves I have here? I made acrylic yarn in shades of brown, beige, terracotta color. They are really beautiful color. Uh, as you can see, this is my this is uh, one normal leaf. And this one, I used my iron steam to make these beautiful corners. I will show you how to use your iron in order to do this similar effect to a real leaf. This one is unfinished. This is the before of the your leaf and this is after. Looks bigger than this one. I will show you the the yarn I used for this. Let me show you more color effects with the same yarn. This one. This one also. And this one in beige. Really beautiful. Uh, I made a top stitch at the center of my leaf to make it uh, look more realistic. I will show you how to do this top stitch with embroidery this really makes a beautiful effect like a real leaf can also use these uh, leaf shapes for your Christmas decoration if you use a, a yarn in shards of uh, green you can uh, decor uh, your home with these beautiful uh, leaves I will show you the yarn I used for these um, for these leaves is this one beautiful mercerized yarn beautiful color uh, if you want to buy this yarn uh, uh, on the link below the box I will start my leaf and I will start with a magic loop I will cast on three stitches on my knit hook I have my first stitch and I will cast on two stitches more. One and two. I have my three stitches and I'll start to knit at the wrong side. Let's knit three pearls. Let's purl three, sorry. One, two, And three. This is row number one. Three stitches. Row number two. We will increase two stitches on this row. Knit the first one. Let's increase on one stitch on this sidebar exactly here between the two stitches. Let's put this stitch on our left needle on this way. And let's knit these, the, these new stitches at the back of our needle, on this way. Let's knit. Knit the next stitch. Cast on another stitch exactly here at the sidebar, exactly here. And let's knit this stitch, but with the knit the knit hook in front on this direction. Knit the last one. And now we have five stitches on our knit hooks. Let's turn. Purl two. Now we are knitting what we are saying. Purl two. Knit one and purl the last two stitches. The stitch we need here in the center is our center leaf stitch, okay? Row number four. 
knit one cast on one stitch on the sidebar exactly here put the stitch on your left needle knit your new stitch at the back knit the next stitch cast on another stitch at the sidebar exactly here put on your knit your left uh, hand and knit to the back and now we have the center stitch is purl let's do a mirror exactly what we did here we will repeat on this side let's cast on one stitch at the sidebar and this one let's knit with our knit uh, hook in front on this way knit the next stitch and cast on another stitch at the sidebar exactly here put the stitch on your uh, left hand row number five purl four knit one purl four one two three four the center stitch knit and purl the next four one two three and four row number six knit two one two increase one stitch on your sidebar put this stitch on your left needle and knit in the back knit the next two one two increase another stitch knit to the back this stitch purl the center stitch and now let's do a mirror let's increase one stitch here and now let's knit on front this uh, stitch increase it knit the next two one two increase another stitch knit in front and knit the last two stitches row number six row number seven let's knit the stitches exactly as they are let's do purl six knit one and purl six row number seven and at row number eight let's do the stitches exactly as they are two let's uh, uh, knit six purl one and knit six row number nine we will do again as they are knit six purl one uh, uh, purl six knit one purl six and at row number 10 let's decrease to do the the leaf shape our pattern repeat is from the row number six till the row number 13 i will meet you at row number 10 to decrease and do the leaf corners I will start row number 10 as you can see we don't have gaps on our leaf stitches and now let's bind off two stitches uh, let's knit the first stitch 
knit the second one and now let's pass this the stitch over this first stitch over the second stitch and we bind off on stitch and we will bind off another stitch the next one knit this one and pass the stitch over like so bind off two stitches as you can see and now let's knit the next stitches till reach this the center stitch knit three one two three let's pour the center stitch and now let's knit the six remaining stitches one two three four five and six this is row number 10 now at my row number 11 I will decrease at the wrong side I will bind off two stitches at the wrong side let's purl one purl the second one and pass the this, this stitch over to bind off let's do the same with the next stitch purl the next and pass the slip over We have the other corner of our sleeve and now let's finish the row number 11 like the stitch we have let's purl three one two three our center stitch is neat let's knit and now we have four stitches to purl one two three and four our leaves start to have shape and now let's do row number 12 and row number 13 is exactly what we have row number 12 let's purl uh, let's knit four purl one knit four row number 13 let's uh, purl four knit one and again purl four and then our row number 14 is the same as the row number six and then our our pattern repeat is from row number six till row number 13 you will repeat for each corner from if row 6 till row number 13 13 has shown here i did it for three times and then i start to decrease to do the shape as a triangle i will meet you here on my third corner and we will start to decrease our stitches to give our uh, leaf shape like this one i will meet you at this corner exactly here you can repeat uh, uh, the, each corner for how many times as you want. In this step, I already have the length I want for this leaf. Uh, I did row number 10 and row number 11, where I decreased in both sides. And now I will start to decrease to do the triangle shape for this leaf. Let's start on the front side to decrease as a triangle. I will knit the first stitch and now to decrease I will knit two together, two stitches together. Now knit one. I will pour the center stitch, knit one, knit two together, 
and knit the last one. Let's turn and at the wrong side we will do the stitches exactly as they are. Purl three, one knit at the center and purl the next three. We have seven stitches at the front side of our work and we will reduce to five stitches. Knit one, knit two together, purl the center stitch, knit two together again, and knit the last stitch. We have five stitches on our uh, knit hooks and at the wrong side we will do two purls, one knit and two purls. Now let's bind off our last row. We have five stitches at our front side, let's knit two together, purl the center stitch and again knit two together. On this way we reduce our stitches to three stitches. Now let's go to the wrong side. Let's purl one stitch, purl the next two together and slip this first stitch over the, the next one. And on this way we finished our leaf. I will put my leaf here at the table and you can see this is how your leaf may look like. This is the front side and this is the wrong side. And now on the next step I will show you how to do the embroidery stitch at the center of our leaf, exactly like this one.